The investigation into a mysterious murder in Alabama ends up in Sequatchie County tonight. Good evening. Thanks for watching News Channel 9 at 6. I'm Calvin Snead. And I'm Kim Chapman. The campus of Gadsden State Community College was shut down this morning when the woman's bloody body was found. Hours later and 130 miles away, her vehicle is located just south of Dunlap. News Channel 9's Kyra Rogers just spoke with investigators about possible suspect information. Kyra, what's the latest? Kim Calvin, the body of Melissa Hudgens was found in a mechanical room on the Gadsden State campus, and that's in Center, Alabama. Tonight, Sequatchie County authorities tell me they found her belongings and the ID of a person of interest in a car just off the highway of 28. This lonely stretch of road just south of Dunlap is where Sequatchie County deputies spotted an abandoned car last night. Around midnight, my deputies had the vehicle towed and uh, after that vehicle towed this morning, we received a call from uh, Alabama authorities and said that the person the vehicle was registered to was found murdered in Alabama. The Cherokee campus of Gadsden State Community College was locked down at 9 a.m. this morning when someone found the body of 32-year-old Melissa Hudgens of Cedar Bluff. She was apparently working as a contractor for the school. Back in Sequatchie, deputies have been busy combing her car for evidence. We're scanning the area for clues. Uh, we have found some clues uh, tying to a person of interest. Among Hudgenson's belongings, detectives found what they call a key piece of evidence, the Gadsden State ID of 37-year-old Benny Leroy Keaton. Sheriff Ronnie Hitchcock says Keaton was spotted yesterday driving Hudgenson's car, but they still aren't sure how it or his identification got here. The Alabama authorities are on their way right now. Depend on us to keep you updated as soon as we gather more information. Kim. Kyra, thank you very much. A quick record search for Vanny Leroy Keaton shows a prior arrest in Sarasota County, Florida for larceny and grand theft auto. If you have any information on his whereabouts, call police.